In Heart of Darkness, evil is lots of things. It's hypocritical, it's maniacal, it's dark and incomprehensible, and it's absurd. As Marlowe travels closer to the heart of darkness, he encounters situation after situation that captures the absurdity of evil, Conrad's second theme. Do you remember Marlowe's visit to the outer station? As Marlowe watches the workers blast away at the hillside there, he realizes that they're blasting with no particular goal in mind. They're basically working to accomplish nothing, and so their exploitation is occurring for no good reason. But perhaps the biggest absurdity of all is the choice Marlowe must make, the choice between two forms of evil. On the one hand, there is the company, a company, by the way, whose colonial activities are rife with hypocrisy, deceit, and brutality. On the other hand, there is Kurtz, a malevolent egomaniac who doesn't play by the rules. Both choices are evil, both choices are ridiculous, and the fact that Marlowe must make a choice at all reinforces Conrad's point that one of evil's most dangerous characteristics is its absurdity. After all, how can you even pass judgment on evil when you're measuring it against a world that's already gone to hell?